Hi guys, welcome to the short video where I'm going to show you a really, really interesting product and it's a timer, of course. Timer is not a new invention and a lot of people are using them, but a lot of people are also not using them. And this is for a reason and it's just because most of them are too difficult to use and so there's a solution to that and it's called the tick time so we have it here you can see it's a really beautiful one comes in two different colors gray and silver here we have the silver one comes also in nice packaging so this could also be a very nice gift for your family members or friends so i'm going to show and explain you everything all the functions all the pros and cons most of the videos about this product are only showing you what you can do but I'm also going to show you what you cannot do so let's start with the basic functions to turn this device on we just have to push at one of these buttons it has two different buttons to turn it off at the end if you don't need it anymore for longer time you can turn it off but it goes into standby anyway and I think the battery lasts for a very long time so usually no need to turn it off so how we use that we flip it down and select any of these times just by rotating very very convenient and it starts blinking then it turns off blinking we turn it around and we can see that it has already started i hope you can see that i take it a little bit closer so you can see it shows the time and it shows this progress circle which is like also counting down which gives you also a very nice indication on how long it will take until you hear the beeping so what we can do at this moment with these two buttons is just to adjust the volume when we push on the left side the volume is decreasing as you can see now we are on a mute volume so when the timer is finished, there won't be anything to hear. There's also no vibration option, but it will be just silent. But we can also increase the volume when we click on the right side. So I'm not going too high. I think it's enough on the first volume. By the way, at the end of the countdown, it will be eight times. Uh, there's no way to stop it unless you put it in an upright position. We can hear that in a moment. Now it will start beeping. You can hear that and we put it in an upright position and it stops beeping. It's not possible to reduce it to let's say just three times or so. Again, no vibration and also there's no repeat of the end signal. If you're sitting in the bathroom too far away when it's finally beeping, then uh, yeah, bad luck. And you cannot uh, take it with you. There's no like a screen lock or so or something like that. Unfortunately, when you take it with you, like in your pocket or so, then it's highly prone to change the time and then it will start again. You can see when you just rotate it, it will start with the new time. So it's not transportable, but it works very, very easy when you have it, let's say on your desk or in the kitchen or outside at your grill or at any sport events or so really really nice thing or it could be also a very nice thing for managers I've heard that a lot of managers they have their open door policy and they give everybody three minutes just three minutes so when one employee enters the door he or she has three minutes to explain what he or she wants so you sit here, employee comes in, you flip it down and then the employee will be even able to see how the time is counting down. Very, very nice, very convenient. Of course, when you're looking from your side, the numbers are upside down. But of course, regarding this design, it was a little bit difficult to support both of the sides. So I think it's not a bad thing to have it like that. By the way, there's also no hold or so, no pause for the time. Even though when you see the time now is stopped and it's blinking, you cannot just put it down again and continue with that. It's not possible. It will start again from three minutes. By the way, of course, you do not only have these 
predefined times. You can also set your own time. When you have it in an upright position, you can start with any minutes or seconds. Here on the left side, you increase the minutes and on the right side, you increase the seconds. By the way, it's only going up. There's no way to go down with the minutes and seconds. If you exceeded the numbers which you want to achieve, you have to put it down and then up again and start from scratch again. Also, when you have your own time, let's say two minutes and it's counting, down it's not possible to reactivate your own predefined time like this two minutes again you will really have to do the two minutes again uh, push two times and then start again it's not going back into the time which you have set previously but there's even more than only timers built in. There's also a timing function. When you hold it like that, it immediately starts to count up, not down. And so you can measure like a time. So when we flip it down, you can see the end result. So here we had 13 seconds. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five. Let's turn it around. How much was it? Four. Yeah, okay. It was close. But I mean, of course, it's not possible to have a very accurate timing then because you lose some time with rotating and flipping it and these things. But still, it can help you to measure some timing. By the way, here you have the full instructions manual. If you're interested in that, I hope it's focusing nicely. If you want to make a better buy decision or you bought used or you lost the instructions, but it's very easy to use. I mean, usually it takes just two minutes or so and then you have it and you probably will will never forget how it works. By the way, it comes also with this charging cable. While it's charging, it's not possible to use it. And in general, I would say it's a really, really attractive device. It's nicely built, looks very sturdy. Again, it's available in two different colors. And so this could be a very, very nice thing, especially when you're using like this in an office. I can tell you, everybody who is coming into your office will ask what this thing is it's such a special attractive design so it could be a very nice gift for your family members or friends or for yourself and so I can highly recommend it and I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it and I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe to the channel thanks for watching see you next time